I'm also clueless when it comes to human interactions of all kinds, not only courting girls or flirting with girls, with women. I'm utterly clueless. And I, I observe people and I read textbooks in order to, to understand or to inculcate in me the capacity to interact with people. But it's secondhand and it's artificial and it's perceived very often as fake. Didn't you have older sisters, older brothers, people like this from whom you I had younger, younger brothers, three of them, and a younger sister. And I was forced to raise all of them because my parents were both mentally ill. So I was forced to raise my siblings on my own. I was parentified. So I became simultaneously an adult when it came to the parent roles. I became a parent to my siblings. And at the same time, I became a student the university at age nine. I, I never had a childhood or an adolescent. Is there, is there research on what parentification, if that's the term, oh, does yes, to psychology? It's quite what, a does lot. what does it do? It, it makes you feel inadequate. But in a nutshell, it makes you feel that you have to serve other people and that you're never doing, you're, you're, never, you're never good enough. You're never doing as much as you should. So you become a people pleaser and you become subservient to other people. And mm. you feel, you have this feeling, knowing feeling that you should serve others. That's the purpose of, that's your raison d'etre. That's the purpose for your existence.